Hello, and welcome to the Daily Almanac for September 16th. So, let's get started. First day in history! <laughs> On this day in history, September 16th, 1877, Jacob Schick was born. He was the inventor and manufacturer of the first successful electric razor. In 1927, he had designed an electric razor powered by a separate motor. By 1931, he had improved his idea and created a new electric shaver with a built-in motor. Then sales really took off. And on this day in 1908, former carriage maker William Durant founded General Motors, GM. He was the man responsible for the beginning of the huge auto manufacturing company headquartered in Detroit, Michigan. And on this date in 1987, two dozen countries, including the United States, signed the Montreal Protocol, a treaty designed to save the Earth's ozone layer by calling on nations to reduce emissions of harmful chemicals. Now, the U.S. Clean Air Act, for example, bans the release of gases from air conditioners and other refrigeration equipment that harm the ozone layer. Today on Word Power, we'll learn about the expression déjà vu. Déjà vu is a French expression that's become part of the English language. Déjà vu means getting the feeling that what you're doing right now has all happened before. The present doesn't feel quite real or solid. It's as if the past is slipping forward and joining with right now. You can get the feeling of deja vu when you see something, hear something, touch something, smell something, or even taste something. Deja vu is just about the only expression in any language that describes this exact feeling. In English, you'd say, I'm having that feeling that all this has happened before. Now that's 10 words. I'm having that feeling that all this has happened before. In French, it just takes two words to say the same thing. Déjà vu. Hey, hey, wait a second. Have I already told you this? <laughs> Today on Extremes, we ask, what is the world's longest cave? The answer is Mammoth Cave in Kentucky. Mammoth Cave has more than 355 miles of passages which have been mapped. That's equal to 563.27 kilometers. It is three times longer than its nearest competitor, located in the Ukraine, which is only 119 miles long, or 191.5 kilometers. The world's third longest cave is the Jewel Cave in South Dakota. Not only is Mammoth Cave the longest in the world, but cave mappers believe that the cave system will eventually prove to be 560 miles long, or 901 kilometers. Health tips. You have one heart, two lungs, 206 bones, and more than 600 muscles. You also have about 60,000 miles of blood vessels. All of these body parts need exercise to stay healthy. Exercise is important for everybody. It doesn't matter if you're young or old, big or little, boy or girl. If you want to be healthy, you need to exercise. The Constitution of the United States is the foundation of our government. In 4,543 words, this document describes the structure of the government and the rights of the American people. The Constitution is known as a living document because it can be changed or amended. But since its ratification, it has only been changed 27 times. The Constitution is a strong document, more powerful than any branch of government or any state. At the same time, 
It is a flexible document, flexible enough to allow for freedom and changes in America. Well, that's all the time we have left today for Daily Almanac. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope to see you tomorrow.